Hey guys, Coach P. Thank you for tuning into my channel. I appreciate it. Please uh, subscribe, like, and share this video with your friends. I'm trying to build this network up and let's see how high we can get it. Today's topic of discussion, the pain zone. What is it and why is it so important for your training? I was taught way back in the 80s about the pain zone. Everyone starts out working out in the gym, getting under a bench press or grabbing a couple of dumbbells and just doing curls, six to eight reps, you know, bench presses, eight or 10 times, whatever weight you can handle. A lot of times it was more weight than you could ever handle just to ego train and get a couple of reps out and you know, impress your friends. But I never really understood the pain zone until I started working with my coach, Bob Gruskin. And the way I was introduced to the pain zone was through drop set training. And I was told, and I learned firsthand Drop set training, your first set is 20 to 25 reps with a weight you can handle. Then as soon as you're done, it's reps to failure. When you're doing that first set and you're hitting that mark of 25 reps, you're feeling the pain in those muscles. You're stimulating muscle tissue. You have blood going into the muscles. That first set is the wake up. Hey, here we go. Now it's time to start training. So the first set is like a little bit of a warm up. We're getting into this and now the pain is coming on. You're feeling it in your muscles. Second set, here it comes. Drop set immediately from say the 50 pound barbell to the 40 and you're repping this out to failure and every single rep hurts so bad you want to scream and you keep repping it out and repping it out and repping it out more and more pain and after you reach failure you drop setting again to the 30 pound barbell again more reps more reps pain is excruciating excruciating pain it hurts like a son of a bitch but you got to keep going and then you go down to that 20 pound barbell and you go into those reps and it hurts like you've never hurt before it feels like the skin wants to split open that's training that's getting into that pain zone. That's when you have the mind-muscle connection locked into that exercise. No matter what exercise it is, I just use barbell curls as an example. The mind-muscle connection in that exercise with all of those drop sets, going into that pain zone and riding that wave through each set of drops getting you deeper and deeper into the pain zone. That's what's stimulating muscle tissue. That's what's gonna get you the growth that you want. That's what's gonna get you that skin splitting pump. Not the people that you see in the gym, picking up some dumbbells and curling one, two, three, or somebody holding a dumbbell up here while they're curling this one and doing it the opposite. You're not training. I don't care if you like what I have to say or not. I don't care what your trainer told you. You're not training. You're wasting your time and you aren't gonna get any results and that's why you get disappointed. I don't understand. I'm working out. I don't see any results. You're not seeing results because you're not training. You have to put your mind into the muscle and you have to get into that pain zone. Whether you're just training just to keep yourself in shape or you're training to get yourselves at the highest level of competition. If you do not stimulate muscle tissue, you are not gonna respond from any kind of training. You have to get into that pain zone. How far you go into it is up to you. I've taken it to the very, very far limits, and it's no joke. But then again, I competed in all the way up to the universe, an international competition. That's what it takes to get to that level. All the guys that came up the ranks with, all the guys from the 80s, all the top Ruskin guys, that's how we trained, in that pain zone. If you don't understand the pain zone, reach out to me. I can explain it to you. I can take you to the gym and put you through that workout. Just ask some of the people I've trained with personally. Ask Kevin Clem, April Long, 
and the list goes on. The guys I train with on a regular basis, the pain zone is no joke. Get rid of that eight to 12 nonsense. It isn't doing anything for you. And anything you're seeing on YouTube or anything you're seeing on TikTok and Instagram, of these people doing these, writing these exercise workouts out, eight to 10 reps, six to eight of this, four to six of this, is bullshit. You're not gonna get the results from that. When you're doing crunches and you're laying in your stomach doing crunches, how many do you usually try to do? 25, 50? So why would you expect to do anything less for your other body parts? Plain and simple, people. You want muscle growth, you want muscle response, you want to see your body change, you got to get into the pain zone. That's why it's so important. You guys have a good day. Peace out.